Now, folks, we are very lucky in London to have some political leaders who really buy into the space for cycling agenda. If only all the political leadership in London would follow their example, but that's what we're here to try and achieve. So, we're going to hear from a few of them now. To begin with, I'm delighted to introduce to you Valerie Shawcroft, Labour Member of the London Assembly and Co-Chair of the GLA Transport Committee and ardent cycling activist. Thank, thank you, Ashok. And can I just start by saying congratulations once again to the London Cycling Campaign for a fantastic event today. Do you know, but also for bringing some real clear vision, some coherence, some coordination, and very clear and deliverable demands into the political arena to try and effect a transformation of our city. I'm uh, standing here today not just as um, a member of the Labour lead member on our transport committee at City Hall on the London Assembly, but also as Labour's transport spokesman in City Hall and a member of our London uh, Labour Party executive. And I just want to say to you that we are 100% committed to the Space for Cycling campaign. We get it now. We absolutely get it. This city must go through a dramatic transformation to make it a city safe for pedestrians, for cyclists, a city that is good for public transport because for the sake of our health in the future, for the sake of our environment now and in the future, it's an absolute no-brainer. We must do this. We've worked together with the other parties on the London Assembly, with the Green Party, with the Liberal Democrat Party, even with our dear friends, the Conservative Party, because actually what matters is if we are going to deliver this city into, into the middle of this century as a really uh, cycling safe city, we need, uh, we need all of the parties to work together. We can't have stop-start changes, we need consistent change, consistent investment and actually we need public support which is why it's so important uh, that you do this today because the audience you're addressing isn't just the politicians, it's, it's the public in London. We all need to get behind this agenda. I think we can do it in London. We can deliver more 20 mile an hour zones. We can deliver uh, segregated parking spaces. We can deliver a removal of all those fast, dangerous gyratories. We can deliver uh, parking spaces um, and I think what is really important to say is that we need to be delivering a cycle friendly London all the way out to the edges not just an inner London agenda this is not just you know a, 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 a commuter cyclist agenda this is an agenda that is relevant to every corner of London and everybody within it young or old male or female so our pledge to you is that over the coming years we will be fighting for investment in London uh, from government from the from City Hall from the local councils uh, for cycling will be invited will be working for the reallocation of road space from car traffic to sustainable uses principal amongst them cycling and we will be working together with all of our parties to all the other parties to make sure this is a one London agenda let's make London a cycling safe city. Thank you. Thank you so much, Val.